for me! Bitch! I hate you! For today's sponsor, we have GVG Mall, where you can acquire your Windows 10 Home serial key for only $16. And using my SKEG discount code will get you 20% off, making it only $11. After the payment, you'll receive the key in your account, and after getting it, you simply need to introduce it in your Windows settings, and BAM! You have an activated system. Hello guys, I should Plays, I'm Fabio Pisco, and welcome to my channel. By the way, sorry about the audio, I know that you're hearing lots of echo, but I actually uh, just bought a microphone, a microphone from Rode uh, to actually use on my smartphone when I'm recording like this, where I don't actually have my AKJ, AKG sorry, microphone. And yeah, it happens that I should have received it like two days ago if the courier wasn't a bunch of fucking idiots. So they came already several times to my home, uh, they delivered several pieces of hardware and now they suddenly say that they can't find the address. So, yeah, I should have the, the microphone like two days ago and now I kind of have to make a complaint and then go there to their base and uh, kind of get the, the microphone, which is, like I said once again, a bunch of idiots. But well, you don't care about that. For today's video, we have the video of how to install Windows 11 in any computer. And when I say any computer, I'm not... I'm not joking, because you can really install it in any computer. Even if your computer doesn't have, for example, the FTPM protocol, the encryption protocol, for example, in terms of motherboard or the CPU, yes, because you have the, the TPM inside the CPU and you have it on the motherboard. For example, on my X570 570 Strix, I can actually enable it uh, in terms of firmware, so the CPU or I can enable it the discrete, the discrete one, which is the one in the motherboard, okay? And yeah, like I said, you don't need the FTPM, you don't need the secure boot, so you can actually install it in any computer. Now, this is a really, a really easy process of basically copying a DLL file from the Windows 10 installation into the Windows 11 installation and then creating an ISO of it. Uh, and to actually facilitate the work for you, I have the link in the description of the no FTPM version already ready for you to download, okay? Um, so basically, I'll, I already did this process. I tried to do it in the Insider Preview, which is the one that we had like yesterday, as you can see in this video, or better, this video. Um, but yeah, it happens that the Insider Preview that I actually managed to download will ask you a serial key, and the Windows 10 serial keys will not work. So the one you have in the description is the developer version, uh, which you can upgrade later to the, in, to the Insider Preview, okay? So it is the developer version that you can install in any computer uh, and you can use the Windows 10 serial keys, okay? So you can get a serial key from Windows 10 and use it, okay? Uh, so basically just get your Windows 10 uh, serial key. If your motherboard is already activated, it will most likely be activated without a problem automatically and then you can upgrade to the insider previews. Uh, I will later leave a link in the description with the insider previews if the serial key part is fixed but for now you have the, the, the first Windows 10 developer preview, the one that was leaked. You can download it here and install it in any computer. Thanks a lot for watching, don't forget hit like, subscribe and share this video and the next ones will in fact be the installation and optimization of Windows, okay? I just bought an SSD just for that and I will do that in this computer, just for you guys to know how to do it. Thanks a lot one more time and see you in the next video.